begin. Okay, they have to be connected, so when you guys get there, fix it. First person to the end of the mat wins. All right, nice job. Hello, PE friends. Uh, this is a game that I came up with yesterday using uh, domino flashcards, and basically, uh, I call it domino dash. And the students tested it out today, just a, a group I had for a little extra time. They were my guinea pigs. And I put it on gym mats. It could be on a, a, a floor space, anywhere you want it to be. It could be any number of players. I did two versus two. And I spread the dominoes, flashcards around the outside. And the first person on each team connects a domino. And then when they get back to the corner of the mat, the next person who was scanning around for the next match and we'll grab theirs and they go until they get to the end of the mat in this case. So it worked out really well. It can be modified easily in so many ways. Uh, they really enjoy it. It goes all the way down to K and one uh, common core math sequencing patterns. So uh, probably all the way up to even grade six, depending on, you know, I'm doing four players, so two versus two. My classes are about 22 to 24. So it comes out to about six sets of dominoes you would need, flashcards. I just printed them out, laminated, and um, it worked out really well. And just to add, you could use real dominoes. There's no reason why you couldn't, and they're actually really cheap in a lot of stores. So I just wanted something a little bit larger for the kids, but there's no reason why you couldn't use real dominoes.